everybody and welcome to Go Comedy. It's now time to go. You can probably get the best show before we start. Please welcome your host, Edith Delaney. Hello, everybody. Welcome to Go Comedy and welcome to Class Show Night. So if you guys ever want to get a drink, um, the QR code's on your tables, just go ahead and scan them, order, uh, order a drink, uh, Brie would be happy to bring it to you, and also, uh, the more you drink, the funnier we get, so please, <laughs> indulge tonight. Uh, you're going to see two great class shows tonight, and then you're going to see a teacher's on set made up of uh, teachers from Go Improv Academy at the very end. It's going to be a lot of fun. So without further ado, let's go ahead and uh, introduce my class, give it up, for the intro three! <laughs> Chairs, but I didn't set the chairs. Uh, we're going to go straight into our first game of the evening. So if I can get playing and a bit over here, for the guys just over on this side. We're going to play a game called At the Movies. Uh, how this game works is that Wayne and Elizabeth are um, kind of like YouTube movie reviewers. Um, they're going to tell you guys about a movie that they've just seen, uh, and we're going to show scenes from that movie. Come back. It's going to be great. Uh, but, in order to do this, we need the name of this movie, and it's not a real movie, and it's not a sequel to a real movie. We're making it all up right here. Does anybody have the name of this movie that does not exist? Purple Suds. Purple Suds? Perfect. Yeah. Uh, Lady Elizabeth just saw Purple Suds. Uh, let's go ahead and see it now. On your mark, get set, go! Hey all, I am Carrie. And I'm Joe. And we just saw the movie Purple Suds. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> this is a very unusual film. Um, I think, you know, with the, the different variety of soaps that we, you know, encounter every day with all the, all the, you know, the, what do you call them, the organic soaps that people use all the time, you know, this one is very, very, you know, appropriate for, you know, our right. times. You know what's really interesting to me, Judd? <laughs> <laughs> We've only been siblings for 20 years. Yeah. It happens. <laughs> you know what's really interesting to me, Joe, is that the star of this movie actually wrote and directed and produced it. Yep, and this is a very, like, you know, like one of those gung-ho people, like very ambitious, yeah. uh, like artistic, art auteur, visionary, you know, it's about... You know what? So, I mean. <laughs> and I think that's really evident in the first scene when we start in the bathroom. Yes. Yeah, so why don't you take a look at that? What's that coming up from the train? <clears throat> it's falling? I... Oh, oh. That's, that's... Oh my lord. Is it, did you pull the sink like, again, Joe? This is not quick unless... I, uh, I don't know what you mean. <laughs> I mean, it is I, COVID! <laughs> oh, what? You think you can defeat me with your trendiness? It looks like a ditto, but like, much dirt. <laughs> <laughs> I need the real soap for this thread. Let's get the purple soap. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> the fact that it was a COVID movie, I did not see that coming. By the way, this is like a horror movie too. So <laughs> yeah. yeah. I, uh, forgot to, you forgot to mention that. You know, just, you know sort of, uh, what do you call it? You know, kids watching, please, you know. Shield your eyes. <laughs> so. It's very scary. Right. Um, COVID's no joke. No. Um, <laughs> and that is why you need the purple soap. Yeah. Don't drop it. Don't. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? You need to drop it in the movie. And it created a that huge was, problem. Yeah, that was like, uh, I was on the edge of my seat on that, in that scene. I mean, it was like when they were all scrambling for... Uh, you know, the treatment, and uh, I, oh my god, there was some, there was like a big, like, family role in Revelation as well. It was amazing. Let's take a look at that. Yeah. Guys, I got the purple soap. Whoa! Oh, I, oh no, no! You can't drop it, it's unstable! Oh, I'm so sorry! Oh, this whole place is incredible. It's the last one. There's soap in Michigan, bro. Last one. COVID could be anywhere. We have to stay vigilant. I can be anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
got you out the air. You can't see me. <laughs> Look at all these dirty fools. Put, put the soap in your mouth. You gotta yeah. stop it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. 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 Oh, I'm doing this. Oh, oh, I'm doing this. I don't think it's easy, but not I use soap. <laughs> how did they. Oh, my God. Like, how immersive was that? <laughs> I was crazy. Like, I just, felt like, like I was there. I know. It was just like. I felt like that just came so close. I'm gonna double check my calendar. I'll like make sure my next, you know, uh, immunization shot or whatever, you know, the, the, the booster. I'm gonna definitely like be on time for that shit. Oh, we got a bit close there. Oh man. You know what though? I really love how this movie ended on such a hopeful, positive, positive? No. <laughs> um, no one died. Um, but uh, you know. It's, it's bittersweet. Let's, let's yeah, just see what happens. Okay. You think your vaccine killed me? The PSA oh, told us how to beat you. Oh, what a good health plan you guys have. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. We used our Pfizer branded purple soap to stop it. <laughs> <laughs> I only weakness. I'm feeling a little bad for the guy. Don't worry. I'll be with you for the rest of your life. No. And oh my gosh, <laughs> emotional. <laughs> I, I think the, the guy who plays the COVID is going to beat Kate Blanchett in this year's Oscars. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. I definitely, definitely see Purple Sun sweeping the Oscars, which is why I give it a three out of five effectiveness for immunity. Ten out of ten sucks, man. Okay. <laughs> Wayne and Abe, if you guys are new on the audience, uh, and uh, we've got Skippy, Evangelist, and Ryan in the back here. Well, next we're going to play a game called Character Creator, and how this works is we are going to figure out a character. Uh, you guys are going to help Cam make a character right here on stage. Then we're going to see, Cam's going to ask some questions, um, and we're going to find out some more about this character, and then we're going to see scenes of this character in their life. So, uh, from uh, this table to that last episode, from this table right here, what's your first name? Any first name at all? Billy. Billy. Uh, from this table right here, what's the last name? Blueberry. Uh, Billy Joe Blueberry. Is what I heard. <laughs> Billy Joe Blueberry is your Joe name. Um, and from this table right here, can I get a, uh, what's a, what's, what's a, uh, it's like more than an occupation, it's his reason to live, you know, the thing that he cares most about in life. What is that? Brussels sprouts. Brussels sprouts. <laughs> yeah, that sounds good. Uh, Billy, from that table, thank you so much, that table. <laughs> um, so Billy Joe Blueberry, obsessed, life is all about Brussels sprouts. Um, let's go ahead and uh, let's get uh, some questions, if you can go ahead and see where those people are in the back there. I really take it away. Billy, Billy. I really can't see, but I see some movement back there. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yes, question. Um, so you actually are from the famous Joe Blueberry Blueberry family. I'm wondering why you decided to switch over to Brussels sprouts. Well, you know what? It started back in my teenage years. I was a rebellious teenager on the farm. And, you know, I was blueberries. I was like, this is stupid. You guys suck. And, uh, the farm down the way. Good old, uh, Rick. Sprout Russell, <laughs> you know, he seemed like a cool guy, and I just, you know, I took up a job at his farm, and the rest is history. Oh, 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 oh. Like the oh. over there. Excuse me. Are you freakishly tall because of the Brussels sprouts or the blueberries? Yeah. It's the Brussels sprouts. My, my wow. family are actually all about two feet tall. Oh. Uh, so that's why uh, I promote Brussels sprouts. Oh, nice. I know your mom. <laughs> yes, uh, thank you. Yes, over there. Growing up as Little Billy, uh, how did you deal with the fact that your parents hated each other? Oh, question. You know, that was a really rough time in my life. I don't know how you found that out. Uh, <laughs> Lucky guess. We, yeah, a lot of separation problems, you know. You know, my mom wanted to do raspberries. My dad was like, no, for seven generations we've done blueberries. And it tore the family apart. It really did. And things have never been the same since. I think we got one Excuse more me, question. sir? Yes, back there. I found your fiance at farmersonly.com. What do you say to that? My fiance? Yes. 
Sarah? No. Sarah. no. <laughs> Me and her are going to have a good talk after this. <laughs> FarmersOnly.com, Tinder, I would have been fine with that, but not FarmersOnly. <laughs> Unforgivable. Um, cool, so we'll take it over there. Um, so now we're going to see three scenes. We're going to see some scenes from, um, you know, Billy's past, from his future, from his present, uh, to see where he came from, what's happening, and all that stuff. Okay, let's take it away. Ready to go? Son, I know things are tough growing up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, things have been rough on the farm lately, Dad. But when you left, your mom ran away too. No, really? Yeah, sure. She's not going to do it for a poor vegetable. It's been five years. Why didn't you tell me this, Dad? Because it took you. You walking faster than me. I can't get you. <laughs> <laughs> That's me. So I was reviewing your data log. It seems that I see a lot of activity from a farmers only. What do you have to say to that, sir? Well, I have a loving fiance. I would never be caught dead on that app. Uh, you're gonna have to explain to me what's happening here. Let's well, see. I uh, catalog. The only person I know who has my credit card info is my fiance, <laughs> <laughs> and she would never do that. Billy. I got something to tell you. What's that? I can't live with these sprouts no more. We used to have a sweet laugh, Billy. Who wants Brussels sprout smoothies? What an idiotic idea for advertising. How am I supposed to know the Brussels sprout market was going to crash in 2017? <laughs> you know, I don't have to worry about this anymore, though. No. I found me another blueberry farmer. No, not the blueberries. <laughs> Brussels sprouts are going to turn around. It's cyclical. Wait. Wait. Next year, I promise. They depend on bacon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. All right, son. All right, your mom's dead. And things are even better. She's convinced me that tomatoes are tomatoes. and a fruit. <laughs> <laughs> we can be together again. Fruits and vegetables. We have to change our names? Yes, her real name, so we'll all be Sally now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, the whole relationship thing, I'm just not concerned about that, but mm -hmm. if you're willing to pay me $300, I can make this go away. Like the, for my fiance? <laughs> <laughs> Are you a hitman? <laughs> <laughs> he just walked into my arm and told me this. I'm very surprised. <laughs> How much you got? <laughs> good news, honey, good news. All those hipster bars, Brussels sprouts are like an appetizer now. Fried bars and bacon, just like you said. We can't sell these things fast enough. These hipsters love this stuff. Are you being honest and true? Yeah. Well, I have another big, big, big announcement. I'm pregnant. You got your own little sprouts to worry about. <laughs> How this game works is uh, Elizabeth. Uh, it's we're gonna get a suggestion from you guys of like an everyday uh, you know chore, something you guys do every day. Elizabeth will come down and start uh, minding that activity. Um, whatever Wayne wants to, he will jump in and start a scene based on that suggestion. But now, when Evangelos joins the scene, he's going to start with a brand new scene, not based on anything else. Then Ryan's gonna join the scene, and we start a brand new scene. Then Abe's gonna join the scene, brand new, again, yeah, brand new. Skippy, brand new. But when Skippy leaves. Makes it uh, reasonably, and then leaves the scene. We go back to Cam's scene, then we go back to Abe's scene, then we go back to Ryan's, and Evangelist, and we finish back in that first scene one more time. So, to just get us started on this very first scene, what's something you do like every week? Power washing. What was this one over here? Power washing. Power washing. You power wash every you every week. You power wash. Your house is outside. Your house is so clean. Uh, this is power washing. Go on your deal, on your market cycle. <laughs> oh my. It's so powerful. <laughs> it's the best on the market. It makes this weekly cleaning so much faster. <laughs> yeah, you are. <laughs> 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 
Baskin and Robbins is going under. Kids don't like our flavors. I think they're too boring. I need you guys to help me think of some new extreme, radical new flavors. Um, okay. Um, for Rocky Road. Is it inside the after I eat it or the suds before I eat it? Suzzy after. All the While you're eating it. All the suds. Experience. Yeah. Crazy experience. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, hey, guys. Uh, I lost my keys. I need to do some place in like 10 minutes. Uh, uh, check, 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 did you put your muffler in backwards or something? My part's all screwed up. What are making boats or cars, guys? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm at the beginning. This is why company's going under. I'm kind of sure this is a new Tesla truck. <laughs> yeah. This really, I don't know what it is. I just give you the thing and you do the thing. I don't know. All right, kids. Line up. Are you all ready? Yay! Yay! You all have your tights on. You know they said swan link with a bunch of five-year-olds was impossible in practice, but you know, I think you guys have the emotional depth, right? No, you guys, you guys have this. I shouldn't be limited to my scope because we're going to score I'm just going to go back here and get a helper. This, so this is the cyber chart we're doing? I think I, so. I can't hammer this stuff. I'm not cut off for this job. So, like, you all audition for the Rockettes? I don't know what I'm doing. That's what I really mean. Look at these legs. They're terrible. I'm going to do some squats. <laughs> I'm not taking your advice again. I didn't find the keys, and now I only have two minutes left. It wasn't up your butt. I'm going to try to run. <laughs> <laughs> this is not helping. <laughs> I'll be a Tom. Oh, there he is. Alright, sorry guys. Uh, we're not digging the purple suds. <coughs> what about, what about, what about moon rock? Suds. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to look into that. I'm going to rock if you ask them to go and check out the problem. Yeah, that sounds like a great idea. Bill, we've talked about this. <laughs> what? what, what you we... can't flirt with me just for the power washer. <laughs> Damn it, I need it though. <laughs> <laughs> Johnny and Victor. There's going to be two scenes going on at the same time. In Skippy's scene with Johnny, uh, we're going to get a suggestion. There's going to be a scene that any time that Ryan wants Evangelist to join his scene, he will say, Victor! And uh, Evangelist will become Victor in that scene over there. Skippy will go, Johnny! And Johnny will run back over here. Victor! And Victor will run back over there. So we need two suggestions uh, in order to set up both scenes that are going on on stage. Uh, from this wall over here, um, what is the location that might fit on this stage? Yeah, like that's about this size, or about the size of this room. A restaurant. A restaurant. You guys are at a restaurant over here. Johnny seen his restaurant. And from these people here, uh, let's go ahead and get a relationship that these two might have. Cops and robbers. Cops and robbers. Cops and robbers. I love it. You guys are cops and robbers. <laughs> and we're going to start over here with a Johnny scene at the restaurant. On your mark, get set, go! What do you want? I got an order for icy wiener. Icy wiener. <laughs> I don't know, man. I just pick up the orders, right? Really, you pick that up and you're like, this seems legitimate. I see Liam. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I can see why you're in delivery. <laughs> um, yeah, so this is a restaurant, so I don't know why we would order food. Hey, Victor. <laughs> thought I talk, talk to you about it. I thought we talked about this last time. I don't want to see you on the streets anymore. The streets where the money is. The money is not yours. Well, I, and everyone else has the money, and as I go up to them, I politely ask them to give it to me. Well, I mean, I respect the fact that you're using your manners, <laughs> but taking things that are not yours, I, I don't have you to. You'd be sharing is caring. And, <laughs> and I have a lot. Hey, that was cute when we were 10, but I'm going to have to put, pull you in. Uh, into it. 
Johnny. <laughs> That's your name, Johnny. Johnny Smith. That's what I'm supposed to believe. Yeah, because I follow my That's what my mom says. Mm, that, that checks out. <laughs> so you got that order of that? Because then if I don't bring it, then soon you probably won't give me another drink. Oh, I get it. No, sorry. I smoked a lot today. No, I'll get that for you. Victor! Victor! I'm going to need you to walk back and forth on a straight line. <laughs> um, you want? Okay, okay. You said I could do the mouth thing. Last time you only did the mouth thing. That was so cool. <laughs> <laughs> Fine. 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 I don't walk straight. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I do you know, uh, last time you did that mouth thing, you know? <laughs> I bought that one. That worked. I actually let like, the smoke comes out of that. That other one that guy gave me, it doesn't work. No? It doesn't even look like that. No, you know, sometimes you just have to take a toothpick and, like, poke through the holes. I mean, you might get splinters in your lungs, but, you know, I had that and I'm fine. I sound like an angel, right? <laughs> <laughs> hey, Victor. So the, the guys at the precinct heard about our exchanges, and uh, I don't have a job anymore, man. Oh, you know what? Yeah, he's a buddy. <laughs> yeah, can you, can you run fast? and carry him things? <laughs> yeah, we're going to talk about that. Yeah, okay, cool. Let's get my place, and we'll talk about it. Fine. All right, Johnny. Here's uh, three medium red chicken sandwiches. <laughs> well, and, and that order? No, oh, <laughs> <laughs> We're going to play a game called Grand Master, and A is going to be in every single scene. Get ready for suggestions to them and come to for a lot of them in just a second, because we're going to see A play different characters in six different scenes. It's going to be crazy. That's why I love Grand Master. Uh, so in Cam's scene, I need a suggestion of a uh, location. Hawaii. 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 Uh, in Wayne's scene, I need a suggestion of relationship. Uncle and a, uncle and nephew. Uncle and nephew. Uncle and nephew. Uh, for uh, Elizabeth's uh, suggestion, let's get a look. something that you heard somebody say today. Something you heard said today. Oh, shit. I heard. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Perfect. Uh, for Ryan's scene, uh, let's get an emotion. Hungry. 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 Uh, for Evangelos and Steve, let's get a, uh, let's get another location. Hawaii. <laughs> different uh, location. Bikini bottom. Bikini bottom. We'll <laughs> see how different Hawaii that is. Perfect. Uh, and for Skippy scene, uh, let's go ahead and, um, let's get a professional. Doctor. 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 Uh, let's quickly run through those suggestions one time. Hawaii. Uncle and nephew. Ah, shit. Hungry? Bikini bottom. Doctor. Sweet. Now let's go ahead with KFC. On your mark, get set, go. I need three pina colada step. Oh, shit. How do you make that? I don't, don't look at me. <laughs> I'm stuck here. I got three corporate executives paying shitloads of money for these pina coladas. I just gotta give it to them. Uh, I just got some butt lag. Do you think they'll notice? Uh, <laughs> I don't think they'll notice, man. Baby, I'm not a corporate executive. Yeah, yeah, they don't know anything. Okay, I'll, I'll take it. You're paying $100. Okay, okay. Uh, hey, all right, nephew, my friend. Suppose so that you don't become like your father. Oh, and I got cheat code? Yeah, I guess a cheat code for life, if you will. Um, so, rule number one is you don't eat the dirt. <laughs> wow! Dirt is actually not good for you. They don't think it's, it's in school. Oh shit, I had your dog bark on the carpet again. <laughs> You're laughing at this? This is our brand new white carpet. I don't know. There's dog bark all over it. And making it that part of it. <laughs> okay, well. Can you just go to the same room, Edgar? No. <laughs> <laughs> Do 
two, two pumps go hungry. You got to see, you got to see, talk about it. Let's go. What was the Taco Bell? Taco Bell. Oh, man. How much, how much this time? Oh, just like a couple of these. <laughs> a leaf. Yeah, like a couple of these. You know. <laughs> <laughs> Have a new idea for a burger. Yeah? So it's it's an animal for the lamb cow. So a cow? <laughs> no, but mouths out of the water on the land. <laughs> 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 okay, it's not made of sea cows. It's amazing. How's that a man? <laughs> cow. <laughs> <laughs> Describe this creature to me. Uh, they roam out by bikini toss. And. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not getting what you're saying. <laughs> so uh, I was, I was, I, fl I tried to flirt with one of my patients the other day. I know that that's not. Oh, you bitch! Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and, and I, said, well, I, I thought I was being cute, and I said, you know, I got a bad case of loving you. I got a bad case of loving you, but I do not love your dog, and so we need to either take it to the shelter. Or kill it. What's wrong with pukey? There's so many things. But first of all, I'm just going to refer you again. New carpet, massive pile of dog and puke. And your dog, it, it, it bit me the other day. Hun, I love you, but it needs to either die or go to the shelter. Hun, I love you. It needs to die or go to the shelter. Well, how else would you make burgers? <laughs> <laughs> Fresh living burgers, you bite into them. You bite right into the land cow? You, it, and you take the rest of it home when you have a really big takeout box. You take the entire cow? Yeah, really, really big takeout boxes. We need to go. We need to go! Oh, okay, you want to go to Taco Bell? Yeah! Okay, okay. Yeah! Your fucking dumb Bud Light pina coladas got me fired from the company. Oh, I don't know, man. I don't know, man. This is coming back on you, dude. I'm gonna tell your manager they're gonna fire you like I got no, fired. No, 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 don't do that. You want a pina colada? <laughs> That's just another Bud Light. Who hired you? This is the worst resort ever. <laughs> Who hired you? This is the worst resort ever that I've ever taken to get a guy. <laughs> hey, yeah, so now, like, because he wasn't, like, into it when I said I had a bad case love you, he, like, took it really seriously, and so now I'm having to, like, make up a bunch of fake medical forms about cases. So, Colin, rule number two is make up fake medical forms <laughs> so that, your, so that uh, your dad can go away very, you know, peacefully. And maybe I can be your dad. Wait, is my dad going to heaven? Uh, maybe. <laughs> <laughs>
I'm, I'm still boy sized, uh, but <laughs> yeah, uh, but you know, it's like, oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be able to grow a beard, have muscles. Yeah, that, no. I'm no. going through that now. You're going down? <laughs> no. Um, I mean, for girls, it's different. Like we always wanted boobs, and they never came in for me. So. It's not that different. <laughs> Didn't come by. <laughs> and it also didn't happen. So we were very similar to we, we were together at the time. <laughs> I just like that it got me out of swimming. Yeah. Uh, uh, that was the best. One you week of the month. Swimming in high school? Wow. Oh, yeah. Give yeah. me some money. Oh, yeah. some money. <laughs> you never felt guilty for getting out of them? No. I always felt guilty. Not no. a Catholic. It's the Catholic. Yeah. <laughs> I feel humiliated because everybody knew because you were doing laps around the pool. You couldn't just sit on the side. You had to walk around the pool. <laughs> I feel so poor. <laughs> I finally started to understand why they were sitting on the edge of the pool. <laughs> It's really deep, and um, and um, I became a woman today. <laughs> yeah. I did not need to know that. Yeah, my mom said that now I'm a woman, and now I have responsibilities. <laughs> yeah, we're only ten. <laughs> we have, like, um, Samantha. Yeah. You forgot your tampons at home. Oh my oh, god, it's, it's so embarrassing. <coughs> Girls, any questions you have, I can answer them. I never want a period. I don't want anything up there. <laughs> it's wonderful for your womanhood. Mom. Yes. This, um, so the tampon, you just like rest it? Here. It's just a resting. Let me show you. We're in trouble. There you go. You're good to go. It's just resting. <laughs> Does it really hurt? <laughs> she I feel like it hurts. Excuse me, ladies. Why aren't you singing? Oh, coach. We're just talking about our bodies. <laughs> They didn't hire another teacher for because they can't afford it, so I have to teach it. <laughs> Listen, oh. I'm selling tampons for five cents. <laughs> it's all good. I, I, I don't have. I don't have enough. Um. Wait, wait. Oh, if I put them around my waist, can I float and then? <laughs> Look at Miss Johnson finds out we're talking. 
talking about boobs. It was at the museum. It's educational. Oh. Oh, so it was like a statue. <laughs> but it was realistic. <laughs> would, look, look, would not be disgusting. Can you describe it in detail? Would not be disgusting. And without using any words. I'll just tell you how I wipe my eyes wet, okay? Yeah, okay. <laughs> 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 it was better than walking down the Mallon Isle in the grocery store. We <laughs> the, it was the art museum? <laughs> yeah. Well, I didn't get our parents to take us to the art museum. They don't hate art, though. No. <laughs> <laughs> we like it. We like it. We're coming of age and we're like, oh, this stuff is so beautiful we now. We can talk about coming of age. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 oh. We are going to right. We need a plan. We need a plan. So, we're going to see some soon. We're going to see it. Yeah. Well, we've, we've seen so many books. Oh, my God. Yeah. Uh, yeah. We've heard dad's groups all the time. Yeah. Like yeah. every day. Legitimately burned my face. We did. <laughs> I literally 
literally cannot find any of my underwear. That's a problem. Jennifer, his breath stunk so bad, I can't kiss him anymore. Yeah, Mom, yeah, you said my breath stunk so bad that she could kiss him. His breath stunk so bad, she would not do anything with him. Hey, Mrs. Jones, um, it's Billy's teacher. Yeah, you're going to have to talk with him about personal hygiene. <laughs> <laughs> Mom, the principal said that um, I can't come to class anymore and my crop top and the top of The museum told me I had to leave because I kept touching its chest. <laughs> uh, yeah, this is Anna, the museum curator. We, we've had all these kids coming in lately, touching everything. Something's got to be done. Yeah, Mom, I misinterpreted holy pants. Class, please sit down. Um, we're going to learn a lot about um, a lot of things in this class in just a few weeks, um, like absence. Yes. Um, my mom's here. <laughs> 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 Um, she wouldn't sign her questions unless she came. So, my mom is absent from my life. <laughs> <laughs> so, ladies, I, I know that you've been uh, dealing with um, periods lately. Yeah, periods. Mm -hmm. And um, I still have my. It's okay. It's okay. You're you're only ten. It's you're actually an early bloomer. I hate it. <laughs> Yeah, me too. It's I, I contemplated getting a hysterectomy. <laughs> it's, it's, uh, uh. <laughs> What's a hysterectomy? Is that something about history? <laughs> I don't like that subject either. Good question. I don't know. Honestly, I have a lot to tell you. Um, first of all, don't have sex ever. <laughs> Just don't. Well, you don't have to worry about that. <laughs> yes. What is sex? <laughs> it's help. <laughs> My husband says I've been abstaining for a while. <laughs> I had an abstain on my my jump. <laughs> Museum. I know. 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 I know.
Wow. Are you worried about yeah. that? Yeah, I think I can do it. Yeah. 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 I didn't even get to see anything. I saw this one statue of a dog and I was like, yes! And then you cut off the dog's boobs and you brought it to school. That's not even the right type of boobs. I had to <laughs> Everyone sees dog's boobs. I, 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 I got one paw and I didn't know if I got the right thing. That's pretty cool. Well look, can I still be like in your like four square game? <laughs> <laughs> let's talk about it. Yeah, let's talk about it. It's impossible to play three square. Yeah, but like you can just one really fast. Okay, okay, let's try. Let's try. Okay, go do it. Can we do it more fast enough? Is that something that might be really good? Okay, uh, we talked about it. Yes. Uh, okay, I'm in. So, um, yeah. it's not you, it's us. Yeah. <laughs> I'm learning new skills like unicycle. You are. Yeah, it's like you do by yourself then. So That's fun. I'm the one, one, one with four people on one bike. With only one wheel, what's that one called? <laughs> Oh, That's what I'm learning. Yeah. That's it. Yeah, have fun. <laughs> learn when, tell us when you learn to ride a bike. Like a regular bike. You were just too good at four square for us. So, <laughs> you live. You're not supposed to compliment him. He's like, no. Come on, get on. <laughs> um, my mom told me I can't do that. Yes, she's supposed to no four seat bike. With one pass. <laughs> I beat it. Okay. I'm gonna try. Hey. Okay. Um. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I've never had someone else on it yet. Come on. We're pointing at each other. Think it through. <laughs> <laughs> I thought we were forward. Which way is forward? It's just by each other. <laughs> <laughs>
spelling bees. <laughs> Everybody does well. W is for what the hell are we spelling? <laughs> Bad news. We're gonna have to mess with um, the boy class. What? Hey, boy class here. <laughs> boy class is here. Oh, no, not they me. just sent me. <laughs> <laughs> no, just me. They just sent me. <laughs> me. Look, oh, I heard that they cut boobs off of a dog sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> ladies, ladies, he'd be a good catch. This old one knows what I'm talking about, right? The school caught our budget, so I'm sorry, but we're mixing with the boy class. Why are you guys all sitting by the side of the table? This is our health time. Oh, hey, they just donated a statue to the pool. Here you go. It expires. Wow. Sorry. Don't worry, Samantha. She'll give us more tampons. <laughs> Coach, I have a question. What's a woman? <laughs> I have that same question. <laughs> well, well, she's show us on the show us on the statue. <laughs> and say that's a woman. That's how it works. It's not what I do. What about boobs? Can you show us boobs on the statue? Billy! These are boobs! <laughs> Billy! My mom's really smart. <laughs> Why doesn't my body look like that? Honesty is the best policy. I'll teach you anything you want to know. <laughs> Mom, why don't our bodies look like that? I also want to know that. <laughs> Maybe if we had someone here that could tell you what a woman is. 
No, I don't think we need that. Coach here. <laughs> hey, coach. Hey, coach. Hey, coach. Hey, coach. Hi. You know what? You know what? That's a very complicated thing. Okay. And we can't define it. <laughs> many have tried, many have failed. But if you feel like you're a woman, if you feel you're in the inner Whitney Houston, and I will always be a woman. Is that statue over there a woman coach? Oh, wait a minute. Look, you guys, you know what's really impressive about what's that? I'm the first woman Irish Catholic priest, so that's pretty cool. And she's my friend. We've been friends for a long time, right? Right? Boom! I've been looking for 
ages, and I can't seem to find one anywhere. The red tenant she's the rarest of the three. Right. <laughs> 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 If you hadn't scared off Sarah, maybe there was a chance that we could appreciate Manifesto. <laughs> <laughs> hey, fellas. Sarah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I work here. You guys sit in my section every day. Arnold <laughs> <laughs> Palmer's can one person have. <laughs> How do you know we're here together? We're clearly fake things you Yeah, we got to play the string game. <laughs> you know the value of the string game. No, I don't. You were only. Can I close it? Can I cash you guys out? <laughs> we're not ready. Now, <laughs> <laughs> you mention it. You sort of like, sort of like waitress law when I ask you, like, hey, you're there, I'll cash out. You sort of. Like, <laughs> <laughs>
that was, if you need to, if you need to trade in your properties to be able to afford one half of the house, we can do that for you. Now listen here, I just happened to land on luxury tax, and boy am I, I am freaking, my pockets are inside out like, like, like a freaking community chess card. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yes. Contract with 
Nike <laughs> and Connect Four. Uh, what do you have to say to your, your family who's watching back home and I'm sure they're very, very proud of you? Fuck you, Dad! Make sure. 
sworn to me that the pineapples were ripe. My servant. Friends, I ask for a humble room for a little old lady, and if I will curse you with that pineapple. <laughs> no, man. There's no way that I'm going to let you into this surfing paradise. <laughs> oh, no! As soon as the final leaf of that pineapple falls, you will look like you for the rest of your day! No, 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 my damn servants, man. Look, the only way that I don't remain this way is if I find true love, and that can't possibly. Oh, someone's at the back door. <laughs> <laughs> we, uh, we saw a haunted pineapple in the window. We're here for the orgy. <laughs> Coming in back doors, come on. So let me get this straight. Yeah. You Ooh, three leaves. No, 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 no. no. Ah, ah, ah. So he's cursed. Yeah. If all the leaves of the pineapple fall off. Yeah. This I'll feels familiar. <laughs> but he has to find. I have to find true love, and the only way that I can think of to do that is to have as many orgies at my house as possible. <laughs> in the hope that I fall in love with one person. Is my shit gonna be haunted? We do this. <laughs> Take care of you, take care of them, um, and have a great